Okay, guys, part four, IELTS listening. Smile. Yeah. Don't smile for IELTS. Smile for any other reason. Any other reason. Okay, yeah. Be happy. Uh, one word only. You have no reason to smile. Really, you're not engaged, huh? And once you are engaged, you have a reason to smile. And once you get married, you have no reason to smile. <laughs> Okay, yeah. no, just joking. This is not my personal experience. This is observation, right? Yeah. All right. So one word only: designing a public building. You might argue, "Mera inna de naal ki taluke." Why are they giving such things to me in IELTS listening? The Taylor Concert Hall. Do you know where the Taylor Concert Hall is? Where? there behind my house yeah somewhere <laughs> anywhere and all that okay so don't worry about that and don't read this very very carefully taylor concert hall the gaane vajde ne like that okay not like this so introduction an introduction you can see the designer of a public building may need to consider the buildings and then there are three points they will talk about all three points one by one and the question is only in point number 2 come on yeah ha na to karo right so once i used to learn like electronics and i used to have an ustad aur wo ustad mujhe kaam sikhata tha so sometimes because of difficulty in anything i used to make a bad face like this and that and my ustad used to say oh muh te siddha rakh So for you all, my message is listening. Hori ne you mute siddha rakho means they should be smile on the face. Okay, not like Jesse difficulty. Vesa vinga chera mute kar liya. Don't worry. Uh, function is the first point they will mention. After this, physical and dash context. Now answer will come with physical. It can it can be before physical or after physical. Physical and dash context. And third is symbolic meaning. Now I play the audio, and you got to find the answer of thirty-one. So, as with a domestic building, when designing a public building, an architect needs to consider the function of the building. For example, is it to be used primarily for entertainment, or for education, or for administration? The second thing the architect needs to think about is the context of the building. This includes its physical location obviously but it also includes the social meaning of the building how it relates to the people it's built for it also includes social. good social meaning and they spoke some extra words along with that as usual okay now we've got question number 32 location and <laughs> concept of the concert hall i'm just thinking about your situation and smiling right All right. Uh, location and concept of the concert hall on the site of disused dash. On the site of disused means it's a place. It can be a, a, a sort of thing. For example, on the site of a disused museum, site of a disused railway station. Disused means it was not used anymore. So site of disused and for disused they will use any other word and then the answer will come. Let's look at the new Taylor Concert Hall in relation to these ideas. The location chosen was a site in a run-down district that has been ignored in previous redevelopment plans. It was occupied by a factory that has been empty for some years. That's been empty for some years. And they used run-down lake district something like that but that was not the answer. So the answer is factory. Very good. uh next is beside a dash very simple whenever they use the word beside the answer will come with by next to adjacent or any word like that okay beside a dash the whole area was some distance from the high rise office blocks of the central business district and shopping center but it was only 1 km from the ring road The site itself was bordered to the north by a canal which had once been used by boats bringing in raw materials when the area was used for manufacturing by a canal and ring road 1 km at the distance and all that so by a canal c a n a l 
Okay, question number 34, building design. It's approached by a dash for pedestrians. Uh, approached by a, by a something uh, for pedestrians. So, how was this reflected in the design of the building? Well, Harrison decided to create pedestrian access to the building and to make use of the presence of water on the site. As people approach the entrance, they therefore have to cross over a bridge. He wanted to give people a feeling of suspense as they see the building first from a distance and then close up. So, bridge. Approached by a bridge for pedestrians. Question number 35. The building is the shape of a... Right? The answer is a shape actually and they can be a trap not circular but actually something like that let's see the first side that people see the southern wall is just a high flat wall uninterrupted by any windows sorry i played the wrong audio it's 35 and the initial impression he wanted to create from the shape of the building as a whole was that of a box Shape of the building, yeah, shape of a box actually. See that answers are very simple, but how they come, that is twisting. Question number 36, one exterior wall acts as a large. Now two things you will focus, act and large. So act means the purpose, they use it for, and for large they can use big. Okay, let's see what that is. The first side that people see, the southern wall, is just a high flat wall uninterrupted by any windows. <laughs> this might sound off-putting, but it supports Harrison's concept of the building, that the person approaching is intrigued and wonders what will be inside. And this flat wall also has another purpose. At night time, projectors are switched on and it functions as a huge screen onto which images are projected. It functions as a huge screen. Functions is X, large is huge. The answer is screen. screen. Very good. Okay, let's go on. Uh, in the auditorium, question number 37. The floor is built on huge pads made of dash. Now, the floor of auditorium is built on huge pads those pads are made of a material. So the answer is that material. The auditorium itself seats 1500 people. The floors supported by 10 massive pads. These are constructed from rubber and so are able to absorb any vibrations from outside and prevent them from affecting the auditorium. These are constructed from Rubber, made of and constructed from material, rubber. Okay, question number 38. The walls are made of local wood and are dash in shape. Again, we've got shape. Made of wood and dash in shape. Circular in shape or whatever. The walls are made of several layers of honey-colored wood, all sourced from local beech trees. In order to improve the acoustic properties of the auditorium and to amplify the sound, they are not straight, they are curved. They are not straight, they are curved. So how do you spell? C-U-R-V-E-D. And D must come with it. If you write only curve, wrong answer. Right? Yeah. Okay, question number 39. Ceiling panels and dash on walls. On walls, there are two things. One is ceiling panel. And second on walls, allow adjustment of acoustics. So, in order to achieve this, there are nine movable panels in the ceiling above the orchestra, which are all individually motorized. And the walls also have curtains, which can be opened or closed to change the acoustics. Yes, walls also have the curtains, right. Last question, evaluation. Some critics say the dash style, dash style means the style of the building or whatever, of the building is inappropriate, like old style, new style, local style, whatever, right? So the answer will come with that. 
The reaction of the public to the new building has generally been positive. However, the evaluation of some critics has been less enthusiastic. In spite of Harrison's efforts to use local materials, they criticise the style of the design as being international rather than local, and say it doesn't reflect features of the landscape or society for which it is built. So, not local. Listen again. The reaction of the public to the new building has generally been positive. However, the evaluation of some critics has been less enthusiastic. In spite of Harrison's efforts to use local materials, they criticise the style of the design as being international rather than local. International rather than local. So the answer is... All right. role. <laughs> You'll feel relaxed. Yeah, in one of the movies, there's a guy who's just upset and the heroine says, Tu na thoda ja role hai. <laughs> okay? So you've come to a place, thoda sa rone se sabar milega. Actually, it's international rather than local. So rather than local means not local, but actually international. International is the right answer. Okay, I'll stay jaan kadaluga, huh? Something like that. Ah, ye ek reason hai. हीरोइन मिल गई तो फिर आप वाइट छोड़ देंगे या तो हीरोइन छह बैंड वाली ढूंढ लें ठीक है या फिर स्पाउस टेस्ट वाली ये है वो सबसे आसान है 